Hello everyone and welcome to today's webinar. My name is Susan Balakis and I'm the Training Development Coordinator at NOW and as such I bring you these webinars on the third Thursday of each month. If you've missed any of them you can find replays on our website nowfoods.com forward slash webinars or on the NOW YouTube channel. If you have any questions during the presentation please use the chat bubble on your screen to submit your question and then we will respond to you with an answer by email. <clears throat> Today's presentation is on BioCell Collagen, the quintessential lifetime wellness ingredient. BioCell Collagen is a versatile nutritional supplement that supports both joint health and moisture retention in mature skin. This predigested complex from chicken sternal cartilage has hydrolyzed collagen and other naturally occurring elements of healthy connective tissues, including chondroitin and hyaluronic acid. With BioCell Collagen, you can promote healthy joint function, comfortable movement, and strong connective tissue while maintaining normal moisture levels in aging skin. So we have a great presentation today. I um, was privy to see it before, uh, before we're presenting today. So um, with us today is Mr. Douglas Jones. He has been a senior executive in sales and marketing with consumer product good comp goods companies in the United States, Canada, Europe, and Asia for over 30 years. He's worked on such brands as BioCell Collagen, Nature Made Vitamins, Minute Made Beverages, and several specialty food and pet brands. Doug joined BioCell Technology in 2017 and he is responsible for global sales and marketing. He has over 25 years experience in nutrition communication, education, advocacy, and policy in the dietary supplement industry. He's also held several leadership roles at the Council for Responsible Nutrition, and he has been an active leader in various nutrition industry groups and is on the board of directors for several local nonprofit organizations. So you are in for a wonderful presentation on biocell collagen and why it is unique and the clinical studies that support it. So with that, I welcome you, Doug. Well, thank you, Sue. It's a pleasure to speak to everybody right now. Um, I have a lot of respect uh, for your company and your leadership uh, with, without a doubt, you know, uh, now as a company and an organization uh, is, uh, one, is one of the premier leaders in this industry. And, you know, I, I'm really honored to be speaking to a great group to, today. Well, today we're gonna to talk about BioCell Collagen. This is the quintessential lifetime wellness ingredient. Uh, and one of the things that uh, we've seen, uh, you know, particularly in this post-pandemic era is from, you know, before the pandemic it was healthy aging. Uh, and then during the pandemic, it was like, what take care of whatever, what I need now. Uh, and now uh, they're really looking for lifetime wellness solutions. And BioCell Collagen uh, is an ingredient that is able to provide that. Uh, just to uh, ground the group, this is a copy of the, for the product that you guys have got out on the shelf uh, and uh, that it's in uh, capsule form. Uh, what we'll talk about today is BioCell Collagen uh, and how it's a clinically proven uh, ingredient. Uh, what makes it unique, uh, and you see this matrix here, uh, and we'll talk about this a little bit later uh, in, in more detail, uh, but it's really the matrix, the bioactive matrix that makes BioCell Collagen unique, uh, and it uh, has, we have clinical evidence uh, for both skin and joint health. Um, one thing I thought I'd share is uh, some recent research from the Collagen Stewardship Alliance, of which we're members. Uh, they do a uh, survey of collagen users uh, uh, across the globe. Uh, and so this particular information is, you know, not only on a global basis, but very applicable in the United States as well. Uh, but that, you know, 50% of uh, each uh, male and females use collagen. Uh, this ingredient is uh, particularly effective for, you know, both for joint uh, and uh, skin issues for men. You know, why do people take collagen? Uh, the number one reason is, is beauty uh, and then joint health. Uh, and then in terms of preferred uh, formats, uh, we see pills as number one, uh, then powder, then capsules. Uh, people interchange, particularly in survey data, you know, what, what 
what one person calls a pill, another person calls a capsule, another person calls a tablet. Uh, and what we also saw is that, and this has been consistent through the, uh, 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 I think about five or six years that they've been doing this uh, survey, that 50% of uh, consumers are looking for branded ingredients. And and for Biocell, you know, what we, in, what we say is not all collagens are alike. You know, I think there are total, I think 26 different collagens uh, that are found in the body. Uh, the primary one is type one. Uh, that is the, you know, our skin, which is the body's largest organ, organ is type one. Uh, type two is particularly found in cartilage. Uh, and then type three is found in various spots throughout the body. Um, I will say I'm not a scientist, so I'm not gonna go into a great amount of uh, detail on that. Uh, but what's important is that this is a proprietary dietary supplement ingredient, and it is when we extract this material uh, and it's extracted from the cartilage in the chicken sternal, uh, and that's the only part of the chicken that we use, you know, we're able to extract a bioactive matrix of hydrolyzed collagen type 2 peptides, chondroitin sulfate, and hyaluronic acid. This, is, this matrix is not a blend of individual ingredients. So, you know, you literally, you know, you just can't put these ingredients together and say you have the same thing. You know, by being, you know, in, in a matrix uh, and a bioactive one at, one, one at that, it's able to get the results. And, you know, we've got seven clinical trials that support that. Uh, this slide will t talks a little bit about uh, the extracellular matrix of both the joint and, uh, and the skin, the histology. Uh, and what we do know is, uh, you know, as we age, you know, the body loses certain nutrients. Uh, it's just, you know, a fact of life. Uh, and so we can see, you know, in the, both in the joint and the skin, the presence of collagen, hyaluronic acid, and chondroitin sulfate. And what biocell collagen does is supplement or replace, uh, you know, these nutrients uh, in the body. And how do we do that? Uh, we do that through a proprietary technology that we have. Um, bio, uh, collagen in its native state, uh, the molecules are very large and not easily absorbed. And so we literally do a, you know, an optimized uh, hydration process in which the ingredient, in which biocell is, is processed and the molecules uh, are reduced in size so they can be easily absorbed into the body. Uh, our method of action is absorption. So it's literally getting into the gut and then getting out into the bloodstream and out to the body. So now we're gonna talk a little bit about the, some of the, the clinical studies that have been conducted. Uh, <clears throat> on skin health, one of the things that when this ingredient was first launched uh, is that it was launched uh, for joint health. And uh, what we started finding right away is consumers were saying, hey, this is working for my joints. Um, but we're seeing, you know, I'm seeing results in my skin. Uh, these are a result of a case, stu case study that a dermatologist did in the early 2000s uh, and really led the company uh, to do additional research in this area. And you can see just in this case study on the before and after show photos, uh, you know, the effect that, uh, that, the, that Biocell was able to uh, uh, affect. Uh, that led the company to do a clinical study in 2012. It's an open label, uh, baseline adjusted for aging signs. And our endpoints were skin dryness, scaling, wrinkles, fine lines, and skin tone, along with collagen in the, in the uh, collagen levels in the blood, uh, uh, or I'm sorry, in the skin dermis, hydration, and uh, blood microcirculation. Uh, these are uh, the, the, some of the charts from the study, and you can see the p-values between baseline and, and week 12, uh, showing uh, improvement in dryness and scaling, uh, facial lines and wrinkles. Uh, and what was interesting <clears throat> is that we, they were, we were able to see that the ingestion of biocell collagen actually stimulated the production of type 1 collagen in the skin so that you're able to see, people were able to see it and recognize that, that healthy glow uh, that so many are looking to achieve. So the conclusions from the study, and these are some of the before and after photos from that, is that we saw a significant reduction of facial lines and wrinkles, 
uh, reduction of sca uh, facial skin dryness and a significant increase in facial dermal con uh, collagen content and microcirculation. <clears throat> that led us uh, to do an even larger study in, uh, that was published in 2019. Uh, this is a randomized double-blind placebo-controlled trial uh, with 113 women, and the uh, dosage was one gram of biocell collagen in 12 weeks. This is a very large study. Uh, we had uh, the, uh, not surprising, uh, we were starting for this uh, study, uh, we had multiple uh, efficacy endpoints uh, that they we were measuring. Uh, they are all listed there. Uh, but the key ones, I think, in the second bullet are you know, our facial lines and wrinkles, uh, crow's feet, texture, smoothness, dryness, and uh, what did we see? So this is the conclusions of the study is that uh, compared to placebo, we saw a significant reduction of facial lines and wrinkles. And by the way, this is a photo that was taken uh, during the study in the lab. So we saw a reduction in facial lines and wrinkles along with crow feet. Uh, then actually an improvement in skin elasticity. So the skin is becoming more su supple and less stiff, uh, as well as an increase in collagen content. And you know what? What was because we were looking at uh, uh, facial improvement. Uh, the the visual indicators, you know, by having these photos, you know, the researchers were able to show that we were, you know, we're demonstrating a more youthful skin appearance. Which you know, as we know, anyone who's taking a product for skin improvement wants to actually see that happen. Uh, there was an uh, increase, not a decrease in skin dryness. And one thing that's been consistent in all the clinical studies that have been conducted over the years for BioCell is that this product is well to tolerated with no adverse events. So uh, what this is able, we were able to support, uh, these are the structure function claims for one gram, that's two 500 milligram doses of BioCell per day, uh, is uh, looking at a reduction of facial lines and wrinkles crow's feet, skin elasticity, dryness, and actually boosting skin collagen and hyaluronic acid. Uh, next, we're gonna talk a little bit about our uh, the joint studies uh, that have been conducted. There are a lot of ingredients uh, that are available in the marketplace for people uh, for joint health conditions. Uh, when I was at Nature Made, uh, you know, we used to do a fair amount of research uh, and one thing that we found, and I think it's well known, is that when a consumer begins to uh, experience uh, joint issues, they start experimenting. They look for a product that works. And BioCell Collagen is a product that has uh, efficacy as well as clinical data to support. So in 2004, there was a published study. It was a randomized double-blind uh, uh, sleep control study. Uh, for uh, measuring joint health, uh, and you can see that uh, we had we saw between placebo and biocell collagen a 40% statistical improvement, um, and this is significant uh, because in joint health, along with other areas, when you're doing a clinical study in joint health, one of the things that you have to take into consideration is the placebo effect. We know that you know once if you give somebody something and say it's for X, and they're just naturally going to feel a little bit better, whether that's true or not. And so you know, it's much harder for a researcher to kind of tease out, you know, what is the real statistical improvement that they're seeing. Uh, and the fact that we were able to demonstrate in this study, it was, uh, it was actually a positive one, needed to say. Uh, that led us to do a second clinical trial, again, a double blind, placebo, a randomized double blind placebo controlled study. Uh, this subject, we had 80 uh, individuals in this study as well. Uh, and, you know, what is, you know, what was gratifying with this study is it basically confirmed the results of the first study uh, and that we were seeing the same statistical improvement in joint health uh, and, and, and in this group as well. Um, so particularly for, uh, you know, any retailer in, in the marketplace, you know, it's important that they have an ingredients that work, uh, uh, you know, for each type of consumer. Because, you know, 
as an example, the cocaine chondroitin is not going to just work for everyone. You know, other ingredients, and there's many in the uh, uh, now portfolio. You know, will meet that need. So, at, uh, this is our, our the structure function claims that we're able to support. Uh, the dosage for this is two grams per day, uh, and we can support promotes joint comfort and mobility, uh, cartilage health and stimulation actually promoting the health of the synovian fluid and boosting levels of hyaluronic acid. What I'm going to talk a little bit about here uh, is just this uh, pilot study we did on sports nutrition. Uh, it is basically a proof of concept study, uh, but it's looking at muscle recovery uh, in a group of uh, weightlifters uh, that were uh, you know, using BioCell. And I'll note the dose here was high at three grams per day, uh, but what it shows us is something that I've been told by uh, people who are much more knowledgeable than I is significant. Uh, but uh, so, you, you know, it's an exercise test, you know, uh, trying to look at muscle recovery. Uh, we are actually <coughs> measuring uh, levels in the blood of C-reactive protein, uh, creatine, and other levels. Uh, and uh, what it was, so what we saw was, uh, you know, an improvement in actually muscle performance uh, in this high intensity exercise group uh, versus placebo. Uh, and for the, uh, you know, what, why this is significant is when I talk to people who are, you know, much more agile than I uh, that have, you know, advanced degrees in nutrition, is where you know that biocell collagen has efficacy in the skin. Uh, it's been well documented and well established. Uh, and the same in uh, the joint. We know we're able to affect joint health. And now with this study, is it showing us, you know, that biocell is having an effect in the muscle? So it is reasonable, you know, to to you know look at biocell collagen as having a systemic overall benefit effect in the body. You know, the body is all interconnected. So the joint, the skin, and the muscle. You know, you know, they're they're not isolated parts of the body. Uh, it, everything is connected, as we all know. Uh, so this has given us some interesting area that we'll be doing some additional research in. And that is what I have for you today. And I thank you for your time. All right, thank you, Doug. Well, um, I love these presentations because I always add it to my list, and <laughs> there's always something I need. And uh, anything that can help with wrinkles as we age, I'm all about it. So uh, best time to take it. Should you take the product in the morning? Uh, yes. Well, the recommended dose is is taking it twice per day. Uh, so if you're taking it, you know, so you should take uh, uh, one dose in the morning, one do dose in the evening. Uh, we do have data that the, the hyaluronic acid level, you know, levels do fluctuate in the body. Uh, so by taking, by spreading this out, you'll maintain the levels of uh, the nutrients in the blood throughout the day. Okay. All right. Well, we just got a couple thank yous, and I thank you once again, Doug. And um, yes, for... thank you. I appreciate it, Sue, and I appreciate you know, by, you know now it's been a great partner, uh, and we look forward to joining the next year. All right. Very good. Well, thanks again, Doug, and thank you everyone for joining us. Take care. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.